adventures of Speedy Turtle continue. Today's wonderful story is titled, Communication with Animals. One day, as Speedy Turtle and his friends were wandering in the forest, they suddenly decided to communicate with the animals around them. They were curious about how to talk to the animals. During this adventure-filled journey, they wanted to develop these skills. First, Speedy Turtle tried to communicate with the birds in the forest. He spread his arms to greet the flapping birds. The birds looked at Speedy Turtle in surprise, but then Speedy Turtle started to sing cheerfully. The birds joined in his joyful song, and together they sang a wonderful tune. Then, Crocodile decided to communicate with the cats in the forest. He approached the cats with a friendly smile, expressing his desire to play. The cats hissed and arched their backs in response, but Crocodile was persistent, trying to convince them to play a bit. Eventually, the cats were swept up in Crocodile's energy and began to play with him. They had a fun game together. Lastly, Rabbit decided to communicate with the squirrels in the forest. He slowly approached the squirrels to catch their attention and greeted them. While the squirrels scurried around in a frenzy, Rabbit offered them some carrots and carrot cake. The squirrels were delighted with this gesture and thanked Rabbit with gratitude. After these funny and enjoyable experiences, Speedy Turtle and his friends discovered how fun and enjoyable it is to communicate with animals. During this adventure-filled journey, they had the opportunity to understand each other better and form a deeper connection with nature. Speedy Turtle and his friends decided to venture deeper into the forest to continue their adventure of communicating with animals. Listening to the mysterious sounds of the forest, they tried to understand the language of nature. First, Speedy Turtle tried to talk to the trees in the forest. He touched them and waved his arms around them to communicate. The trees responded by rustling with a gentle breeze and fluttering their leaves. Speedy Turtle approached the tree slowly and thanked them. Then, Crocodile decided to talk to the rivers in the forest. He approached the calm waters of the rivers and greeted them naturally. The rivers responded with a soft murmur the flow of the water. Crocodile watched the natural beauty of the rivers with a light shining in his eyes. Rabbit wanted to listen to the chirping of the birds in the forest. He listened carefully to the surroundings. He tuned into the joyful songs of the birds. The birds responded to his loving gaze by singing even more spiritedly. Rabbit smiled peacefully while listening to the music of nature. After these wonderful experiences, Speedy Turtle and his friends discovered how powerful an experience it is to listen to the sounds of nature and understand its language. This silent conversation brought them closer to the depths of nature and increased their desire to uncover the mysterious secrets of nature. Speedy Turtle and his friends continued to move deeper into the forest, listening to the sounds of nature and trying to understand its language. This time, they were determined to discover the magical language of nature. Speedy Turtle tried to communicate with the insects living in the forest. He approached them gently and said hello, trying to enter their world. The insects responded with tiny sounds and movements. Speedy Turtle observed their way of life. He looked at them respectfully, learning how they communicated with each other. Crocodile decided to communicate with the snakes in the forest. He slowly approached the snakes and started to talk to them. 
The snakes reacted by slithering sinuously and sticking out their tongues. But Crocodile tried to understand the language of the snakes and managed to establish a friendly dialogue. As they roamed the depths of the forest together, this communication with the snakes became an unforgettable experience for him. Rabbit approached the rabbit holes in the forest, trying to communicate with other rabbits. The rabbits reacted by quickly running into their holes, but Rabbit patiently waited, calling out to them with reassuring sounds. Eventually, the other rabbits also came out curiously and started to play with Rabbit. Rabbit was delighted with this friendly interaction with the other rabbits. After these unique experiences, Speedy Turtle and his friends discovered how beautiful an experience it is to understand the magical language of nature and communicate with animals. This communication with the wonderful creatures living in the depths of nature increased their respect for nature, strengthening their desire to deeply explore the beauties of the forest. I'm sweet girl, Linda. Our story ends here, dear friends. If you like adventure stories like this, I'm always telling them. If you subscribe to my channel, you will find more stories that you will enjoy and have fun with. See you in new adventures. Goodbye.